In this video, we will continue on on the question how to make a vertical gradient bar chart using Chart.js. This is part two and it was mainly because in here we had the question. This is one of my other videos where I eventually post an answer from Ferun. And what was happening here is, or at least what I realized afterwards was that I made a mistake or I misread the question, which was to make the horizontal uh, which my uh, my gradient color, which was horizontal, and that was not what he was looking for. What he was looking for was a vertical version. So eventually, I gave an answer, which was here with the linear gradient. However, I just want to make sure, and I do figure out that probably he already solved it, but I just want to make me sure that the answer was clear. All right, so. This is just a tiny mistake here, or basically just a switch of the items. What we're going to do here is basically adjust this one. And if you do not know what these are, I would highly recommend you to do the following. Watch part one first before you even do this, because this is just a continuation of. So I'm going to remove or change this. I will grab this here and put this on the left. And then I say this one will be on zero. And then here, the X one will be focus on the right so it's from left to right and then we remove this one here the bottom will make this so what will happen eventually this will create what we call a vertical version so we go back here now and refresh and pay attention now you can see it starts to become vertical and we could even if ever desired adjust this one more time adding up here some extra colors just for fun so we can just say here this will be we do this on zero and then at 0 0.25 we will get uh, red and then after that at 0 0.5 we will get yellow and then we have another one let's put in here or what might be orange will be 0 0.75 so what will happen is you have different colors consistently coming here from left to right in a uh, vertical level so basically the color is changing up from top to bottom and that's basically what he was looking for thank you for watching this video and i hope you enjoy it and if you enjoy this video you probably will enjoy this one as well and if you're interested in chart.js check out in the description box the link directing to my chart.js course where you can learn everything about chart.js and finally of course make sure you subscribe to my channel